Hello guys for here and today we're gonna be playing Dima Firmacraft. Uh it's been a while since I've actually done this. Oh. Is this not how you gather items? Was it Because you destroy in one click. Oh my! Oh my! <laughs> oh it's like what? I cannot pick up anything. Looks like okay, there, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's just yeah, you just right click it. Okay. Oh, we already found casts it. To write. I believe this is an or, and I'm pretty sure I just completely pronounced that name wrong. Um, but let's just pick some of this up, and then we need to get some rocks. So, I'm a bit inexperienced, but wow, we are finding what the heck? We have so many ores. I don't know what ore this is, but I know this is like ores. Um, so, to first start off, we need to use the wiki because. Uh, if you don't have the wiki usually in the first few days, it's practically impossible to know what to do. So as you've already seen, so, uh, like seen in within the first few seconds of my video, we have something called napping, and I'm gonna quickly pull up the wiki here, and I'm gonna want to craft myself an axe head first. So we're gonna do this, this, and then we can do something like that, and that creates an axe head. And then you get the achievement Paleolithic. And then, hooray, we got stone axe. <laughs> so now we can gather trees, so that's gonna be useful. So let's get some of these. Um, and I remember how long it takes to break down trees, so we have to be a bit patient. Um, and then now we need to figure out what else do we want. Um, I'm probably gonna make myself a shovel, that's a simple one. Um, oh my, look at all that. Alright, so actually. Let's see. Yeah, so we're gonna create ourselves a shovel. Let's do that. And then we need what else do we need? Because I remember which is a way we can saw this down, but I don't exactly remember how to get saws. Um just like hammers, javelin, hose. And so I'm not exactly sure how to wood. What's the first thing I usually get with wood? Alright, so saws. Uh, let's see how we can do this. Uh, let's try this again. Actually, you know, I think we'll just stick to this for now. I think we just need some ba these two basic tools. Um, and, okay, so we have... <laughs> I know, I'm depending so much on the... I guess, what do you call it? The wiki here, and I apologize, but you can't judge me. Okay, so first off, so, okay, we're probably going to have to focus this a bit later on. Um, but to start off, we need to make sure we get, um, like, we have to get lots of different things, so, honestly, it's not gonna, it's not gonna come immediately, so, alright, let's get some of this, and then, let's also grab, let's keep grabbing more rocks, and then, some, yeah, oh yeah, we need, uh, cast, we need to get some more cast, to right, I don't know how to pronounce that, alright, man, <laughs> we need to get some more of these, so we can, um, Make ores. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how much. I believe we need a hundred. A hundred. That's way too much. Um, about ten. Uh, so let's go ahead and just keep grabbing these off, and then wait. Wait a moment. I think we actually need this. I moment. Yeah, these are clay plants, and then we can get a clay from here. Oh man, that was actually quite surprising. <laughs> I was like, I believe if memory serves me correct, we actually need these. Like, is it because of the flower or it was because we had to dig under it? Alright, so clay is going to be useful because it allows us to create pottery. Wow, we're finding all time, kinds of stuff that we can't, like, use at all. Um, but clay is going to allow us to create storage. It's going to allow us to, um, actually make the saw. I want to get the saw first as my main project because it definitely gives a more wider variety for building. Um, actually, or is it a copper better? I actually don't know. I don't know what step people usually take within this point, but... Um, alright. I think we should pop- Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, if we, uh... If we go back here, I remember something. If we want to do, uh, some, I guess what you call it, uh, forging, we need to create a knife, right? So, um... Alright, let's do napping, and then we need to- This is called napping, by the way. It's not like N-A-P-P-I-N-G, but this is, uh, K-N-A-P-P-I-N-G, so... Alright, knife blade. 
boop boop bibbidi boop bop boop. Aha, there we go. And then we use the knife blade not as a weapon, because this actually does a lot less damage than the stone axe. But we use it to get uh straw. And when you get a straw, you can make a satch. Alright, not the pirate from Bahala, but you can make Satch. <laughs> Alright, so let's gather some more of these. Um, Alright, and I know how to drink water already. Um, it's not too hard, you just need to find catnip and then you can just use that. Um, but I think what we should do before we do anything else as we continue. I think this is a nice spot. You know what, let's uh, open this spot a bit. Let's take over this area, because why not? It's a, it's a nice area. Why, what am I doing? We can't craft sticks yet. We just need to do this. And then we need a fire starter, and after that, let's actually go around and look for sticks because we need a we need to create a fireplace. Ooh, another limonite. I really wish I knew what ores these were. It's called limonite, but it could possibly be copper or something. Or oh, this is native gold. This is quite obvious what it is, but we don't use this for a bit, so I can't really do much with those. All right, so let's keep going. So yeah, usually the beginning requires tons and tons of um, research because it introduces a lot of basic features which you don't get to know about from the beginning of the game. There's no like tutorial level or something. It just immediately sews you in here, so yeah, you can't really do much unless you can... I think we... no, uh, wait, achievements. Okay, so I think this is actually going to be useful. Make two still knife heads at once. <laughs> oh, troll. Has something to the metal age, so we need to figure out the metal age. Yeah, it doesn't tell you much, it doesn't tell you about picking the pot and having to s start smelting it. Alright, so let's do this. I believe it's two of them, and then we can try setting this on fire, maybe. Um, I don't know. Am I doing this right? Yeah, let's try. Oh, yeah, there may be one straw. It. Aha! There we go. Alright, so first off, we can definitely put sticks in here and get torches, so that's gonna be useful. Um, if we wanna, if we wanna live, because we practically need these to survive. And I'm just making sure I know how to make a fire and such. I'm probably not gonna stay here for long. Um, because we need to travel around and get ourselves some food. But, ooh, we got two trees at once. Alright, um. Alright, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to break this. Uh, we don't really need it right now. So, uh, right now what I need to do is go hunting. We need to go look for food because we're going to starve to death. This game isn't too kind with giving you starter food. It just immediately sends you off, you know? It's kind of like action survival. You won't, maybe on a plane crash or something, you won't have food because maybe all the food was burnt. I mean, you probably spend a few days trying to find some, which is, I agree, not a bad idea, but... Ooh, is it? I remember something. I remember something. Survival instincts here. Is it possible that this... It's, this is a rough... <laughs> this is a rough edge. Jeez, let me get down there. I'm also going to grab more sticks, because we really need those. Um, but survival instincts here, can we... We know. Well, I know what... Is this the drinking one, or is this seaweed? This is seaweed, and then I can combine seaweed, and then I can use this as an actual food source. It's like actually a really good one. Uh, how much do I have? One. Oh. Well, yeah, this is actually gonna be really good. This is useful because uh, this, I think it's a good starter food. I'm not sure if everyone uses this as starter food or not. Um, but I wasn't sure if this was a catnip or I wasn't sure if this was seaweed. I remember once I was playing around with this and I found seaweed. So this would be something nice to have, <laughs> and then we can do something like this, we can, yeah, we can craft it together, so and then it creates uh, a larger amount, so you see that's 5.5, 5.3, 4.0, and it creates a larger amount, and then we can just com keep combining these so we have one large food source. I really like this feature though, I feel like Minecraft should do this, so you can like, s it's a better way to stack up steak, I really like uh, this way of doing it. Um, I really applaud the creators though with this mod overall. I really love the way of, uh, I guess, creating 
survival Minecraft because <laughs> this is honestly one of my favorite mods to watch and I've always wanted to play it it's just I never really had a good enough computer because it's a mod once again so I get major lag and such but now I've gotten myself uh, a new start I got myself um, a better computer and I guess yeah this will be cool to just do um uh, let's 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 not drown. We're gonna combine series again. Uh, we can put only 160 at most, but that's still a good food amount. Alright. So I think that's gonna be fine for now. Um, Alright, let's keep going. What's this? Is that more? That's more limonite. Alright, looks like there's more limonite around here. And I apologize for my sniffly nose, but... <laughs> I, I, I like the way I called it. Sniffly nose. Uh, I can't- okay, can I have- stop giving me two different ones, I need one so and then I can use it. Because it's completely useless that we only have like six and eight. Because I'm pretty sure these are different ores and if they're different ores, we can't do much with them, can't we? Um, oh god, so now that I'm thinking about it, I think what I need to do is, is make a pickaxe first. Oh uh, wait, we can do this way, we can uh, yeah, we can uh, create like pots and stuff, and then that's how we uh, smelt the ores, and we got a major lag spike right there, holy, alright, uh, let's see if we can get some, uh, whoa, 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 what's going on here, oh yeah, I'm creating new land, like I'm going further into the distance, so we're gonna get a lot of major lag spikes here, because every time it creates a new area, it really, like, it really kills your computer. Like, this for example, oh my. I, I want to keep exploring, I want to see what else the world has to offer. Show me your lag spikes, world! Show me what you can do! <laughs> Alright, so I'll make some of those high school dramas or something. I really, sh I, I just realized I need to turn off my gamma. Um, because I remember in PvP, I don't really use torches, and then everything else is bright by default. That's what's happening right now, and that's really killing the moment. I'm really, like, st stupid that I forgot to uh, fix it, but it's okay. So this is water, so we can uh, get fresh drinks from this. So, yeah, I'm Bill Grills. I'm going to teach you how to drink water from extremely unsafe sources that could potentially kill you. But no, seriously, don't randomly drink water in the wilderness. As much as this game supports it, it will most likely, most likely kill you. I don't know if it can kill you or not in this game, but I've never been killed by drinking unsafe water sources. Um, and I don't want that happening, so... Alright, um, let's see. It's a nice mountain area. Alright, so I think what I should do is I'm gonna... I'm gonna take hold here. And then we're gonna just get some of this thatch real quick. Or hay, or whatever you wanna call it. Uh, so something I remember is you can maybe use torches. Like, is that a thing? I think that's not a thing. <laughs> I think that's not a thing. I'm pretty sure it is, I'm probably just doing it wrong. Alright, let's just get the fire starter up. Up, oh, okay, our fire starter's done. Maybe... Let's try putting the hay straw a bit closer. There we go. Now you guys are best buddies. Alright, let's keep doing this. Come on, I'm making a fire. Come on. There we go. Also, don't stand on this. This will light you on fire and kill you. <laughs> so, I'm so chill about it. Alright, so we need to cook this. Let's make this warm. Let's give it a nice toasty feeling. Also, let's give it this gravel. We don't need this. I'm also going to gather some lily pads. This will be useful, maybe, in some cases, I don't know. Alright, so we have a light, regular amount, it's no longer cold. I'm pretty sure by making it, like, more exquisite, more delicious, we can, uh, make a lot better of a food source. So, uh, let's do this, let's put some logs in here. Um, it's warm. I don't know if it's gonna reach... I don't know if that's, like the best part. Alright, let's try this. Oh, it's too hot. Okay, so I can't eat this. Um, Alright, let's craft ourselves some more torches in. And actually, what I need to do is I need to get myself some of the clay crafting guides. Clay forming. Alright, so... 
can I don't want to know about the advanced tools like chisels and javelins, but I want to know more about um, pottery. Aha, there we go. Alright, so we need to... Let's do this first. Oh, oh I remember this. Um, not that. <laughs> we can do something like this. This, 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 this. I want to get one of these so I can preserve water, I believe. Oh yeah, we need to sm smelt it. Whoops. I don't know how to fire these. Oh yeah, we have to place it and then put it in hay. And then we light down on fire. Okay, okay, um, I'm getting a bit more memory. Okay, so we're gonna do this now. We're gonna get a clay vessel. I'm gonna make two of them. Uh, one for maybe storage, one for a possible smelting. We're gonna get... I'm gonna get a mold. I messed that one up. Whoops. Two clay molds. Ooh, fun. And I think that's what I mainly need. So now what we can do... Let's also eat some seaweed. Oh wow, this is a good food source. How much do we eat per bite? We get about five, and that gives a really good amount. Ooh, that's it. That's a good start. All right. Uh, let's put. What am I doing? Uh, you're not supposed to sort in now. All right. So what we can do is we can shift click this stuff. Uh, we're gonna get one more. I don't think we need it. And then I can do this. And then. Was it to put the rest of the blocks? Whoops, I did not mean to get that last one. <laughs> oh gosh, now we going to take forever. Alright, I think we got it. And then we can do this. Or we saw a torch on it. Aha! There we go. Uh, let me quickly. Yeah, so that's gonna take a bit um, to form. So we're gonna get into copper tools soon. In natural survival, we probably wouldn't have. I keep messing this up. But in natural survival, we wouldn't have a wiki on how to survive one on one. I'm pretty sure those don't, those don't exist, which sucks. But all right. So after a while, that should finally put out, and then we should be able to have clay items. But I think that's gonna be the end of the episode. Um, we had a good start on this. Um, I feel like we got some basic stone tools. We got basic idea of crafting. We're gonna make ourselves um, some clay stuff here, which will be useful. And yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.